Hey, what's up? This is Peter Newton, and today we're going to be shooting projectiles at the mouse's location. And as you can see, I'm using a top-down template. And that is a blueprint template within the Unreal 4 editor. And let's start off by going to Blueprints, Open Class Blueprint, and My Controller. As you can see, I have it docked right here. And we're going to start off by extending this common area. Now you can adapt this to any setup you have, but this is what I'm going to do for today. I'm going to add a pin. And one of the first things we want to do is we want to create a gate. And what the gate is going to do is allow the spawning of the objects at a consistent rate. And we're going to have the gate open and closed by the left mouse button. So when the left uh, mouse button is clicked, the gate is open. When it's released, it is closed. And we want to, in order to have a consistent uh, delay, I mean a consistent rate and not have it race, we want to add a small delay on the gate. And then we want to do spawn actor. Ooh, wrong one. And do spawn actor from class. All right. And I assume you have your projectile already made. Mine is a chair uh, because my blue man is pissed off today. He's gonna he's gonna be throwing chairs in the classroom. Uh, he's uh, not have a good childhood. All right, we're gonna get controlled pawn, and this is uh, basically the actor of this controller. And you want to get the actor's location. And what we want to do is, in order to tell the actor where to spawn and the rotation, we need to get hit result under cursor by channel and whatever is under the mouse at that time it will give us the location of where that is so we want to do break hit results and it's uh we can scoot this up a little bit and it stays uh inside we want to do find at look rotation We also want to get make transform. And this will be for the spawn actor class. So let's uh, throw in a rotation. And since we want this to spawn near the player, but not directly on the player, let's actually get vector plus vector. And, that's, and this way we can offset it. And we're going to put it. 100 units in front and another thing we want to do at least for my case I'm gonna put it over the character because uh, he's throwing chairs he's not shooting anything necessarily but you know it all works uh, you're shooting bullets I'm throwing chairs it's cool we all are gonna be happy at the end of the day and uh, I believe that's it let's go try this out compile Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Actually. Yeah, this is cool. All right. So if this has helped you, uh, feel free to comment. Maybe you have different other solutions that you uh, came up with for this. And if you need any help or uh, you have any questions, let me know. All right. Later, guys. Peace. Hey, thanks for watching my tutorial. I'll be uploading more every week. So be sure to subscribe and peace.